Howdy. Uh, the purpose of this video is to show you how to get up and running using Vesta. Uh, and it's going to be very quick because Vesta is very easy to use. Um, Vesta is a visualizer. Uh, it's an uh, open, um, it's a, a free visualizer that anybody has access to. Uh, and we use it to look at crystal structures. Um, so if you have a SIF file that you are going to refine or you're about, or you have already refined, um, you can use it basically to visualize the structure. Um, so what you want to do ahead of time is download the program. Uh, you can do that at this link here uh, and uh, obtain whatever SIF file it is that you want to look at. Um, and so if you haven't already uh, seen this, a great source of SIF files is the crystallogra crystallography.net. Um, that's the crystallographic open database uh, where it's a repository of about uh, half a mile, million um, crystallographic information files that folks have refined um, in a number of different studies and all kinds of materials are in here. Um, uh, again, Vista is just one uh, example of a visualizer, but it's pretty easy to get up and running. Uh, and it's something that works both on Windows, Mac, and, uh, and Linux. So uh, download whatever version you need. Once you've done that, uh, you can um, open up uh, in Windows. It's a executable file. Uh, it probably would look a little bit different in whatever uh, you see in Mac or Linux. Um, so once you're here, it's very easy. We're just going to open, uh, browse to whatever SIF file you want to open. And so I'm going to open this quartz file that I downloaded previously. Uh, and there we go. So this is a single unit cell. Um, in this case, silicon is blue. Uh, oxygen is red. Um, you can change how we look at uh, the uh, atoms. So it's very common in ionic structures to think about things as polyhedra. So there's a cation that's coordinated by um, some number of anions. So here we can see the silicon uh, cation is sitting in the middle uh, of, a, of, a, of a tetrahedron with oxygen at each corners. Um, and each of these tetrahedron are corner sharing with one other uh, tetrahedron. Um, so there are a lot of utilities. You can measure uh, bond distances, uh, bond angles in Vesta. Uh, I'm going to show you one uh, simple thing uh, that uh, sometimes uh, we want to do. Um, and if we go to edit data, unit cell, uh, come down here to transform. Um, all I'm going to do is make a super cell that is twice as big um, as the original unit cell. And so this is allowing us to see a little bit more of the, of the structure. Um, so say, okay, yes, okay, apply, uh, and there we go. Um, so this is, again, a supercell, a two by two by two um, uh, example of the quartz crystal structure. But allows us to basically see a little bit more of what's going on. Um, so that's it. This is a tool that you can use to look at crystal structures um, and to read SIF files that you uh, are going to work with or perhaps have already refined using uh, an XRD refinement software like Mod. All right.